Hello everybody troop, welcome back, I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. Welcome back on this beautiful Tuesday, how are you guys? Let me know in the comments below, are you ready? for this Tuesday. Girl, it is time to talk about the real housewife of Beret Hills because Harry Hamlin is still talking about Lisa Rena out there, you know, and it is very, very, very funny the things that he is putting into the universe. Like, girl, honestly, this is insane. And now apparently he is blaming Sutton Strack for Lisa Rena being fired off the show. And we definitely, definitely need to talk about it. But before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you want to support my channel. Now you can do it through the thank button right here. And you can check my merch on the link on the description below. And let's talk about this mess. Away. Not today, Satan. Not today, Nick. Not today, ankles. We don't have it. Questions. Where's my cocktail? Where? That's my opinion. All right. You ruined it. You ruined it. You did. Uh, what the f is this? The lies. There you the go. Lies. There you go. <laughs> you are the biggest bully in Hollywood, and everyone knows it. Welcome back, everyone. And girl, it is time to talk about the Real Housewife of Beret Hills because Harry Hamlin now is being vocal. Okay, like now he's talking, now he's showing his face everywhere, and now he is like telling left and right, you know, things about Lisa Rena, how she was so amazing, how she never lies, how she this and that, you know, and apparently he was on Sundance the other day, and he claimed that the one who May basically made Lisa Rena to be fired was none other than Sutton Strack. And I was like, what? I mean, are we even like watching the same show? Like, are we like, what? I mean, we all know that the, the only reason why Lisa Rena was fired is because of Lisa Rena. And if you want to blame someone, like your number, like your first choice should be like Kathy Hilton, right? But Sutton Strack, girl, this guy, this poor guy, he is so lost in life. Like, he doesn't get it. Okay, let me read you this very quickly. It says, Harry Hamlin claims that Lisa Rena left the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills because viewers sided with Sutton Strack in the coaster feud over Elton John gala tickets. A page six pie over her hamling telling a group of people during the Sundance Film Festival on Saturday that the Rena Beauty founder might still be on the show had the fight not happened. Harry Hamlin further claimed that IMDb actually provide him and Lisa Rena with tickets to the Elton John AIDS Foundation Academy Award viewing party in 2019 and not Sutton Strack, despite the boutique owner's claims. She might still be on the show had Sutton not said that, he continued according to our spy. She might still be on the show, but the audience believe Sutton. Um, okay. I mean, I keep telling you guys, please, let's let's do a, a GoFundMe, let's do something, no, but that's for money, I, I don't know what, like a petition, like, let's check on Harry Hamlin, okay, because something is not adding up. First of all, we never, ever heard about Harry Hamlin during the eight years that Lisa Arena was on The Real Houses of Beverly Hills. Like, we never heard anything about her, from him. Like, he will do his little scenes here and there. And that was pretty much it, you know? And now he is everywhere. You know, like, it is, it is so crazy. I mean, is he being, is he brainwashed? Is he, like, living in another year? Like, why? Because it really doesn't make sense. Like, I was telling you, like, like, completely close like 
he did his little scenes here and there. I mean, he he always like supported Lisa Rena from the house, you know, and he was always. I mean, I my thing is like I feel like yes, you can defend your wife, okay, and you can be oblivious to certain things, but you cannot live in denial especially with someone that is creating so much controversy, right? Like people are talking about her and the things that she has been doing. And we have Harry Hamlin here saying the other day that, that Lisa Rena never t- uh, tell any lies. Girl, the amount of lies that have come from Lisa Rena's mouth, it's insane, you know? And now... He's saying that Sutton is the reason why Lisa Rena was fired? I mean, it doesn't even have anything to do. Do you think that we really care that much about the, the Elton John tickets? I think Lisa Rena care more about the Elton John ticket scandals that we did. You know, like, yeah, that gave us, like, a good week of, like, tea, but we would, like, move on from that, and we honestly never thought about it anymore, right? And he's there like, oh, yeah, I know. That's the reason. That's the reason. It's like, hmm, I don't know. What about the other, the uh, like, eight years that your wife did all the bullshit that she did on the show? I mean, may, that's maybe a bigger reason. What about, like, all the people that boo her at BravoCon in front of the executives? You know, that might be a reason, you know? What about going up against Kathy Hilton? That might be a reason. But, like, girl, seriously? It doesn't even make any sense. So I keep saying, someone check on Harry Hamlin because something, something is not adding up. That poor man, I mean, he, he just need to be joining um, Ray Huger on Florida, you know, and just go there and watch at the Pretty Little Birds, you know, maybe with Tom Girardi or something. Because, girl, I mean, it's, 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 it's giving a whole other level of thing. Like, watch the show, okay? Or even better, talk to your wife. Tell her, to, tell her to tell you the truth, okay? <laughs> because, because you are, you are um, embarrassing yourself, like doing these kind of comments that doesn't have anything to do. So, anyways, let me know what you guys think on the comments below about all of this mess. Do you think that Sutton Strike was the reason why Lisa Rena was fired? Let me know. And like always, don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye. Hello everyone and before we start it is time to give a shout out to our partners of this video and are the beautiful people of Rose Forever. They did this amazing bouquet of flowers with special oils that will make the roses last up to a year. This is the perfect gift for you, your mom, your wife, your husband, whatever you want to say, I'm sorry, I love you, I miss you, say it with these beautiful flowers. So if you want to get your bouquet right now, go to the link on the description below and use my discount code ANDY25 and you will get $25 off your order. Again, this is the perfect gift for anyone. So whatever you want to say, say it with roses from Rose Forever.